at Fairview Gardens in Goleta, California, they're cultivating a very important crop, a future generation of California farmers. All right. Awesome. If you ask a group of kids, how many of them want to be farmers when they grow up? Almost half of their hands just shoot right up in the air. They're very excited about farming. There's nine weeks of camp. Kids get to learn how to garden, they harvest snacks, they play in the trees, they tell stories and play games. Yeah, but I'll come back. Feel it, feel it, it's still warm. Why is it? I like harvesting the plants, that's fun. When we were harvesting our own carrots, it like gave you a sense of having your own food and it was really cool. Executive Director Mark Tolufson launched the Farm Camp program in 2010. Today, it's just one part of a broad range of programs designed to fulfill the vision of Fairview's founders. It started back in the 1970s when a couple named Roger and Cornelia Chapman purchased the property with the idea that they could preserve it for agriculture and education. Because uh, people say that Roger was a true visionary, that he saw what was going to be happening in the Goleta Valley, which is so rich in topsoil, it's such rich farmland but he saw that eventually it was going to be turned into houses. So his, his, his expressed idea was to preserve this land and be able to provide it as an opportunity for people to learn about agriculture. The unique part about our 12 and a half acres is that we are entirely in the urban corridor. So we're surrounded by houses on three sides and a major road and churches and schools on the fourth side. So for schools to come and visit us, they don't have to drive 50 or 60 miles out into the country. There's many schools that can walk here. You check it out, it's a pretty magical little garden. During the school year, we have a lot of schools come to the farm. They request to have tours of our farm. <laughs> so you can tell what color eggs. And kids get to explore the fields and harvest, usually carrots. And uh, we do a composting lesson at the end with the carrot tops. So thanks for doing your part today, you guys, and helping us make even better soil here on the farm. It's not just the local schools who benefit from having a farm just down the road. Fairview Gardens programs make it a valuable resource for the entire community. This is hard work, you guys. You're so strong. It's really fabulous how the community is using Fairview Gardens as a resource to be able to uh, um, take what we're doing here at Fairview Gardens and bring it back out into the community. They really get our mission. They really get that we're here to, to explore the critical connections between community, agriculture, and education. We run probably 30 or 40 different types of classes. Our Suburban Homesteading Series is a series to reskill adults and uh, so in things like how do you make soaps and salves and lotions in a way that are body care products that are really healthy for us and healthy for the environment. Gardening techniques for dryland climates. The kids at farm camp may not grow up to be farmers, but Tolson believes that forging connections between the community and the land is essential for the future of the small urban farm. Really the small diverse family farms that were around every city and every community across the country historically have also been gathering places where people came and connected back to, to our landscape. So at Fairview Gardens, we are a place where people can come and gather. We are a place where community can get to know each other again. I feel that really the, the future of our farms in this country is really based on our ability to build healthy, strong, resilient community. We do that, we have a future.